Men, are you looking to up your game and capture the hearts of many around you? Well, the only way you're going to do that is with an official Delete This Fuzzy Walrus t-shirt. Yes, you can look just like this absolute unit. Look at him. Fear him. He is the end bringer. And yes... This shirt can be yours for the low, low price of like $20 plus extra money if you're a big guy like me, and then shipping, which is like four bucks. Uh, but yeah, it could be totally yours, and you should totally buy one and help the channel delete this shirt. Description, card, let's do it. I, you didn't see anything. I, I didn't just show off the blaster. You have to watch the video to see the blaster, or skip to the end of the video. You can do that too. Onwards! I think both of us are really tired right now. But we decided to hang out today. This tastes like garbage. It does taste like garbage. The plan, which you might not even see this video if the plan doesn't come to fruition, but Jose did this thing where he went to the dollar store and made a homemade blaster. And not like, not like a crappy blaster, although it was pretty terrible. And I think really the only problem was the spring, right? Mm hmm The spring and uh, the seal. So this is part two of that, where we're gonna go down to my local dollar store. And for those of you who live outside the US, this might be somewhat educational. And we're going to see exactly if we can make another homemade, this time properly, using only materials from the dollar store. No cheating. So, if it works, you'll see this video. If it doesn't, you won't see this video. I like them odds. Dollar store flip flops. It's one of those things that, yeah, buy one of those. Oh. All right, yeah. All right, you can get a lighter for the cell phone. You can get samurai glass. All the tools. He's got nicer, tool, nicer tools than what I have at home. You can get armor all at the dollar store. <laughs> get net rollers. Have to buy the entire package when we only need like the one. Yeah, make something that fires that. You work the slide. Buy turkey bacon at the dollar store. Mm. Perfect. So no, that's dirty enough. Mm. Yeah, I'm getting two. <laughs> Give it a shot. Get one of those rival colors, bro. <laughs> Instead of this. Instead of this. Uh, there's a blue one. <laughs> so, uh... This is what we got to uh, hopefully. Why the frick are there latex gloves in here? For reasons. 
Uh, okay. Uh, hopefully not rear reasons. This is the stuff we got to build a blaster. Uh, let's briefly go over it like these uh, LR44s that go in my uh, gashat here. I'll just put that off to the side for right now. And uh, let's see, we got... This is like a trigger guard slash trigger that you want to put on. Yep. It's uh, over the door hooks, actually probably useful. Uh, washable markers for the old school modders that know these make excellent barrels. Uh, this garbage, it's supposed to make a noise and it doesn't. <laughs> you got the one that didn't make a noise. I mean, technically it makes a noise, just not the one we want. Sound one. It doesn't do anything. Uh, this could be barrel, I think is why we got it. We got a couple of different things, or at least barrel shroud. Close pins, uh, you already know where this is going. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, uh, we'll, we'll get, we're not gonna spoil the surprise of what that's for. Uh, googly eyes, cause you gotta have googly eyes, that adds like 15 FPS. These are our idea of what's actually going to uh, provide the spring. And I'm honestly wondering here, oh, this is gonna make such a mess. Uh, bag. Yeah. Do it in the bag. Do it in the bag, that's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> I don't wanna spray graffiti. How does this even work? I twist it up, right? <laughs> Why didn't you? Oh, rotate arrow. Just unscrewed it. Oh, God. Ooh. Uh. So this is graduation themed. <laughs> oh, hey, that's not long enough. Cool, we think we got four of them. Might make one that looks usable. That's definitely not long enough of a spring. We're uh, yeah. You think so? It's, it's really beefy. tough. It's beefy, it might work, but uh, I, I'm not hopeful. So we might have to, is that the one thing that might not be from the dollar store? That's I don't I want everything to be from the dollar store, but yeah, yeah. this is uh we'll see. This is not looking good. Just based off the spring, yeah. It's beefy, so it is really strong. Alright, so, so you may open the other ones well. Yeah, might as well pillage these things. And probably shoot it into the bag. <laughs> <laughs> Again, that's what she said. Yeah. <laughs> Let's hold it backwards. We got uh, one Aiko. Oh, did you grab that? Yeah, oh. it was half off, so we only paid 50 cents. Aiko! Aiko, come here. Over here. Gosh. Gosh. Yes. Oh, my Aiko loves me. We also got some uh, screwdrivers. Why? Uh, this is actually what we're gonna use for the pin for the catch. So that's a thing. Um, we got this as a backup in case our plunger tube doesn't work, which that is gonna be our plunger tube. These They're squirt guns. Oh, you are getting so fat. Come here. Uh, this is actually a balloon filler. I'm gonna take your, here you go. This is a plastic balloon pump that uh, it's actually dual staged. Yeah. That's the dumbest thing. I mean, How did they make a dual stage pump for a dollar? Um, it's just like a rubber gasket back here. Yeah. The spring. Uh, maybe. Of course, wait. We can't take the heads off, can we? It's plea lubed. Yeah. We might have to figure out a different way to pry. Oh, we can use one of these too. Yeah, my hip. There we go. Nice. <laughs> and our survey says perfectly. <laughs> Literally perfectly. Doubles. Yeah, we can double it. Oh my That'll god. That'll work perfectly. Oh. Oh my god. I am happy. We are we are ecstatic. Yeah. There's no way a catch is going to be able to handle that spring load. Cool, so this is gonna be a thing. Oh, we didn't buy super glue. We should have bought super glue there. Oh. Okay, well you we're fa we're cheating because you can buy super glue at the uh, yeah. dollar store. Yeah, nunchaku. Yeah, 
Yeah. Half. It's like a horse brake action. Oh, pull the front. Oh god, how was I supposed to figure that out? So. Luckily, I had one before, so. <laughs> I'm gonna grab some of this garbage. Okay. Well, I mean, I don't know what I'm expecting for dollar store caps, but... Yeah. Oh, I should've bought more so I could reload faster. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> That's it. Oh, yeah, the grip. <laughs> yeah, the grip on this one. That's what we're using for the grit. Oh my god. <laughs> That's our grip? Yeah, pretty much just cut it off. Right here. Get rid we of that. couldn't come up with a better option, like no. grabbing like a plunger or something. Nope. Because. Two shots. It's gonna be nice. And then you put the clothespin here, put the pin right here, so they grab the plunger head. Perfect. I think I think it's good. Yep. <laughs> do you have pliers or do you just gnaw the end off? They're not toxic, right? Nah. Uh, 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 no, no, we're just pins. How do you get the end out of there? Just push. This. Well, I cut the head off. You're not supposed to. Doesn't push back? She just push oh no. And now. Oh my god, that does not fit. Yeah, it doesn't. Like. Did you get the twist? It's a twist fit. <laughs> it's a twist fit. I mean, technically? Are you doubtful of my skills? <laughs> oh yeah, we have to have a grip guard. What part of this do you use? For me, uh, for what I did is I cut here and then glued it to the bottom. So uh, this was this was a trigger. This so all this was garbage. But if you want to do a grip card, yeah, we'll cool. do a grip card. Yeah, okay. it's gonna be the coolest looking dollar store homemade. I mean, it, it already is. I mean, you got the. I'm gonna laugh when this thing hits like 140 FPS. It's not. Dollar it's store, not. 140 it's, FPS blaster. It's not. I'll eat my own shoot. Never mind. No, if you're it does, you're starting to doubt yourself. It is. Because that's a lot of sting. I've got a bandsaw. He's got a bandsaw. <laughs> okay, that was effective. <laughs> oh, it smells like stanking. Sorry. Dude, I think it's out of new barrel. Sorry. Shower. <laughs> That's the thing that was supposed to make noise. Oh. Oh, it's just slightly too loose. Might be good for like a air blaster. Maybe. <laughs> so this was supposed to make the noise. I just. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Yeah. I'll add it to my collection. Yeah. Got that? Yeah. What part of this makes noise? This blaster is nothing! Yeah, it's a spring and a pin. It's actually less than the other one that we had. Well, already split, so time to cut the rest of it. <laughs> Wait, you split it? It's a lot of compression. Yeah. That doesn't go all the way forward. Yeah, you can always bring the plunger closer. Uh, I need an adult. I need an adult. Let's open this site off camera. <laughs> <laughs> just imagine. This is gonna be the best. Yeah, <laughs> right through his butt cheeks. <laughs> Oh, that makes me happy. Is that the smallest size? Yeah. Put him on his abs. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Why? Yes! Yes! Alright. Let's pour in some of this super glue. 
Out the hot glue. I don't know if they saw a hot glue gun there. I actually didn't check. They might. I never saw one. But the hot glue sticks a dollar. Yeah. Super glue a dollar. They have super glue. So I pull that. It's supposed to go like It's supposed to go like that. Yeah, so we're gonna have a hole going through the top all the way and a little bit in here. This will go in like this and be glued here. And then this will just free float in the plunger tube, so when we pull back, it'll catch. You pull down, this goes down, releases it. That's a snap up. That's gonna. That's actually going. I don't think that's gonna withstand the pressure of this. Uh, you'll be surprised. I will be surprised, because. The only, the, the only thing I'm gonna say right now, I think might fail, is the actual plunger tube itself, because that's gonna have stress on it in here, too. Ooh, yeah, that's yeah, the yeah. only reason I was worried about this. We only need to get, like, a couple of shots off of it, so. Yeah, and then worst case scenario. We could always get something else and reinforce it from the outside, but, but whatever. Yeah, oh, what's friends? Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, my baby. Get out of there. Stop touching each other. Whoa. Oh, hey, if we heat this, we can bend it. How do you call a sling point? <laughs> Have a heat gun. <laughs> no. <laughs> That's just stupid. Ugh. Let me see how these. Did I just ruin that for you? Yeah. <laughs> just kidding. This might be too long of a plunger tube. It might be. We might have to shorten it, which is dumb. We've already shortened it, but... I'm thinking that's what the issue is. Because that's sad. Well, no. I mean, that's still gonna get, That would get a lot of pressure. You can also double the spring. <laughs> it's been like... <laughs> it's been like a half hour. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> I just look at it. <laughs> it's evolved a little. <laughs> we have... Zombie John Cena <laughs> with the googly eyes, <laughs> and he looks through his right into his hand, <laughs> and it's got a grip guard. <laughs> My face is starting to hurt. <laughs> this is the best homemade ever. Yeah. Screw the caliper. <laughs> I'm gonna set this. <laughs> this doesn't serve me here. Right now. <laughs> <sighs> it's, uh, it's the greatest homemade ever made. What does it get for performance? High of 72. I think the lowest was 68. It's entirely made out of garbage from the dollar store. The only thing are the screws. And I would argue we could also get those from the dollar store if we bought a bunch of stuff and just ripped the screws out of them. Yeah. I don't think that's fair. Like, the screw that's in here is obviously from this blaster, but... Freaking camera died. But this is... I, you stare at John Cena's butt to aim the blaster. <laughs> and that is not a phrase I ever thought I would say on this channel. And he's a zombie because he's got the headband on his head. And the googly eyes, he's a super zombie. You gotta... This, I, I can't. I can't. 
this was how long? About two hours. Yeah. To for us to completely build. Yeah, because the seal was kind of an issue. The seal was the biggest issue. But That's where I cut it. Is when we were having issues with the seal. Yeah. And I just, it's it, you can't you. This is the dollar store challenge again. I mean, you can count the the hot glue and the super glue. And that would be another two dollars, so it'd be a ten dollar build. And yeah, at that point, you could just go out and buy a blaster. Yeah. But we're we're really mincing words here, because if you had most of these parts that we didn't have to get, like if you had a marker free, if you had a grip free, a nail free, you're taking dollars off this. It's like a five dollar build, except for we turned it more because of all the extra stuff. Yeah, we made it. We made it awesome. We made it amazing. Yeah. I this is this was mostly Jose's idea. He did a prototype of this, mm -hmm. but this is almost completely different than what he did. Yes. Yeah. It's still a snap pistol, but this is more efficient cuz my plunger tube was huge and it performed worse. His gigantic pistol but, performed worse. Is, look how tiny this is. It, it outperforms a jolt. It, yeah. I, I, I can't ask for more. And it looks hilarious. If I were to spray paint this silver, it'd look like a, something from, like, a noisy cricket. Mm -hmm. I mean, this thing... I What more can I say about it? It's... It's hilarious. 70 FPS. 72 was the me. highest. And it's amazingly consistent. I think the standard deviation is, like, two. Mm -hmm. Two or three. Like... I, I can't. I, I this is the coolest thing I ever. And of course, again, oh, it's the springs. Oh yeah. So the springs that was one dollar for two. We used two. Yeah, one dollar for two springs. So plunger tube, dollar. The spacer came from that tube thing, so that's another dollar. So that's three dollars. Four dollars barrel. Five dollar for the rubber glove that went over the O-ring. Mm -hmm. Six dollar for the grip. Seven dollars for this. $8 for the clothespin, yeah. $9 for the pin, yeah. uh, $10 for hot glue, $11 for the super glue, mm. but, I mean, not counting all of that garbage. And, yeah, I mean, we, you could easily make this for half the cost if you had a clothespin, if you had a nail, if you had a rubber glove laying around that you could cut off, or even just a better O-ring to put on it, uh, if you had a spring... Might but, I add, 36 clothespins for a dollar? <laughs> yeah, 36 clothespins, we only needed one. Yeah. This is this is the dumbest thing. And it hasn't broken yet. We fired yeah. like three dozen darts through it, and it has not broken. I... I don't even... I, the way he stands. <laughs> he's like this. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I can't. Every time I look at it, it hurts. <laughs> it's ready to get you. <sighs> oh, orange muzzle. <laughs> oh, the orange muzzle for safety. It's for safety. In case oh. someone thinks this is real. <laughs> it's a real gun. <laughs> God. I don't. I love it so much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, okay. All right. <laughs> oh, my face hurts so much. What do we do for a front post? <laughs> what do we do for a front post? We didn't think about that. That's fine. It's not super accurate to begin with. Yeah. God. Uh, I can't. Sideways googly eye? <laughs> no. I can't deal with this, dude. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Dollar store challenge complete. Did it hit 100 FPS? It may maybe if we had better parts, but 70 FPS for some dollar store garbage. It's an elite dollar store With pistol. a trigger. With a trigger. That's the important. Like, you can, of course, buy, like, a super soaker. Like, you could just have put a barrel on that thing and just slammed it and probably got higher FPS. Yeah. But it has a trigger. It works. 
I, I don't, I can't. It's, it's the best thing. And once you get used to how to prime it, it's dead simple. Yeah. Uh, even a better barrel. Oh God, I just pulled that out of the, I wanted to break on the trigger so hard. There we go. He's like, it works so great. Yeah, <laughs> even a better, like I could crush this in my hand. Oh yeah. But even a better barrel, this is hilarious. I, I can't, like, I can't, we won't pass this. It will never be surpassed. Yeah. But that's a challenge to everybody else. Can you build a better dollar store pistol? I'd love to hear it down, and this has to be like dollar store. You can't buy a pre-existing blaster. You have to make a homemade using dollar store parts. Like, you can't buy a blaster and pull the spring out of it. That's lying. That's cheating. You can't take a thing and use the barrel. You have to make a homemade with it. And I would love to see if anybody can beat this, we will have a video on it. You need to send me proof. But this is the best. I guess another dollar for the tape. I didn't count that. The cosmetic. <laughs> yeah, Come cosmetic. On. I mean. Cosmetic and safety. And safety. That's just, you have to. I just, I, this is the coolest thing ever. Cool. I really hope you enjoyed this one. Thank you very much, Lucia Thor. Yeah, no Jose. Problem. I don't know what to call you anymore. You might as well just name me Jose Lucha Thor. Jose Thor. <laughs> Jose Thor. Uh, his channel will pop up all over the place, and of course in the description. And, uh, jeez. I, I love it. This is awesome. Thank you very much. Uh, I, I, I'm Walcom and Jose Lucha Thor. <laughs> I'm, I'm broken. I'm drained. All day. This has been a great two, day. We went, what, an hour and a half to go shopping for all the parts, and then two hours, two and a half hours to build it. Yeah. And then miss filming and doing all this. It's too much. Yeah, dude. <sighs> all right, let's get the hell out of here. Bye.